he good enough to defeat the unbeaten Joseph Parker, who's younger by two years, but he's slightly smaller. Introducing first, fighting out of the red corner with his trainer, Kevin Barry, wearing white with black. He stands six feet four. His official weight, 16 stone, 12 pounds, seven ounces, equivalent 236 one half pounds. His professional record is a perfect one. 24 fights, 24 victories, including 18 wins by knockout. He is the fighting pride of New Zealand, the reigning, defending, undefeated WBO heavyweight champion of the world, Lupisol Eai, La Ole Ole Maleatoa, Joseph And his opponent across the ring, fighting out of the blue corner with his trainer, Rob McCracken. He's wearing white and stands six feet six, officially weighing in at 17 stone, four pounds, two ounces, equivalent 242, one quarter pounds. This Olympic gold medal champion now as a professional has a perfect record. 20 fights, 20 victories, 20 wins by knockout. He is the heavyweight fighting pride of the United Kingdom, the reigning, defending, undefeated WBA, IBF, IBO, heavyweight champion of the world, AJ Anthony Joshua. Let's get Joshua, remember the, the, the dressing room, okay? Good luck. On the line, 44 wins between them. Just under 80,000 here on this momentous occasion. Two home one is so relaxed anyway, but... Joshua with the right hand. The pressure back against the ropes here. Just looking for the body shot there, Joshua. Almost towering over Parker, who gets close. And also... Swing in a body shot. Parker just gone back in his shell. One, two, one, two, off. Yeah, left. Yeah. 30. Yeah, relax. Nice rhythm now. Put him up. But the Samoans here as well. Fantastic win, play and reach. Straight away imposing. Out of range. Parker, he goes in again. It's jerky from Parker as he tries to get his own jab going. Good defence from Joshua, who spears a right hand back. And, look at, and for Joshua, another undefeated foe. Joshua with the feet, threatening all the time. Can't be coming back. He knows that Joshua has been floored by Klitschko, but he did well. Throw the right hand to Parker. He just can't seem to get... Seconds out, round three. Giving away the naturally late change for Kubrat Pulev. And Joshua, but it's controlled boxing. So far, Joshua's not had to throw many punches yet, but the punches he's thrown. And then all the noise out of the Parker camp was good in Vegas. Joshua beginning to drill a couple of people clamoring for Joshua Wilder, but he's got business to take care of first. Right hand and a combination. You can see that power with the speed as well. The speed's explosive. I don't know if I've ever seen well. Joshua with those legs, but there's a left hand from the other one. A little bit of swelling around the left eye of Parker looking to get in a raid, but annoyed with himself. That was a clash of heads. You're giving Joshua all the rounds, I think, online. With Joshua backing up Parker. It's going to be the moment. He's never been down, amateur or pro. He's looking like he's sort of twitching, not enjoying what's coming back in. Great jab, he walked straight into that. Yeah, just off balance there. Joshua in the line. That's a jab on the right hand. Effective at the gating. And he could stop him in his tracks with the jab. Weak against Luis Ortiz when in trouble. Got through the very back. Just looking to get inside. That long reach. Six inch for Parker. And that 
jab as Parker came in. And feel the power difference in that. Oh, Kevin Barry made no real secret that get his man through the first few rounds and then come on strong. And here comes Parker with the deep pressure to Joshua. This is good. The jab solid from Joshua. Ringside mom, Salah, dad, Dempsey. Trying to engage and begin to go toe to toe. Because of Joshua's size and and he's very cunning here in, in terms of his game plan because this is better for him. And possibly take Joshua late. I thought that Joseph Parker was able to get close. Anthony Joshua, as we all know, came to the sport much later. And here we go. Starts to unload here. Joshua went for it and now it's turning into a bomb. Bam. his chin. He's starting to increase it here, Parker. Joshua match. Well, he caught Parker, Parker there, Joshua, but big right. Joseph Parker. And Joshua misses on the right hand. Joseph Parker as he backs off from Joshua, but the speed from Parker. And the right hand is what. Doesn't look as happy in the subtle. And Parker's into this contest. Making a real fight of it here for, for AJ, not having it all his own way. Looking so powerful as he backs up. No one's made a statement yet. I think, you know, no one's really landed a big punch to determine which way the fight's going to swing. Some, some lovely boxing through his game, this thing, this fight, he really has. He's dictated with the jab. He so, has been used many times in the... Parker, who won the WBO title against Parker. Cute. Joshua, the distance. Joshua. He looks in control, but up close as he tries the uppercut to South Lee Spitlick. I think he might be there. The referee's very keen and very eager, and these big lumps come together. Body shots. Looking for the right-hand counter there. Joshua too cute for it. Backing up Joseph Parker, but Joseph Parker... Keep hitting their body. Don't race for the pipes in this fight, particularly early behind that jab. And there it goes. shot. But this is the stage where I'm expecting Joseph. Yeah, the referee really doesn't like these two. It's a bit disappointing, really, because up close, unless they're hot. Seeking out the angles. Is he the one to look to hold? He knows the referee's going to be breaking them up. So a lot of focus on Joshua as Parker comes in nice to re-establish with the jab and a left hand, and that got through. And Parker has to take it. The referee steps in to break them apart. Shots, not much to separate in this round, but some good shots from Joshua. And that takes me well loose for about a minute. What will Deontay Wilder be making by having that sort of? Scintillating performance. Says your punches and a half sustained success. For judging two. Fury and one. Oh, surely the perfect one. Yeah, such a good shot. Joshua Lawrence. Couldn't block that right hand though, Parker. But he comes in in those cameos. Well, every time Joshua. So every time Parker steps in close and gets near to hold on to him, knowing that the referee will bring him up. Steve, so it's subjective, isn't it? Good work from Joshua there, stepped to the in the tenth round. Parker under pressure. The referee certainly hasn't impressed those of you online watching. Very really is Joshua on his back foot. And as soon as Joshua comes close, and Joshua's again the take very loose on the left side of Joshua. Parker oh, in this. Coming forward, but he seems to be with me, but he's just not having enough success. You've still got Joshua in a very handy lead, haven't you, Carl? Yes, I've got Joshua. He tried to work the body up close, but referee quick to. That's better from Parker. That nice short right hand to the bodies. Vladimir Klitschko took him the longest in this jab. Some really good points to the new look Joshua, and there's the uppercut as well. That's been the most impressive weapon for Joshua. Yeah, Parker's work. Oh, that's well. good work for Joshua, but back comes Parker. No real effect, but Parker backing up here, looking for Joshua, which will then tip it. 
Joshua's way on the cards. Signs of from the referee then. Will he go for the knockout? Will he box his last scorecard here? He doesn't need to take any chances. Don't take any risk. Just box behind the jab. Anthony Joshua tonight. But Joseph Parker suggests that Joshua possesses. Yeah, there's been some real good body work from Parker on his way in. Instead of sitting back like he is now, because Joshua is so much trying, he's kept believing all the way through. But when he's on his back regime, has paid off. Oh, yeah. Can't wait, wait for Joshua. He hasn't, he hasn't managed to get that ribbon. He has got punches yeah. through. And the referee jumped in to intervene. Again, definitely not the referee's night. Respect for the two of them, and it will go to the scorecards. And Steve Gray from Britain. I think they believe that they've won it by a fair few rounds. Anthony Joshua! By eight twice, and by nine once. Unanimous. 21 and 0. Parker losing for the very first time. He tried his best, he pot shotted, plenty of work rate and maybe his structure, his composure. Hitting of every round, but did enough to be one margin. Listen, this is called boxing, it's not called fighting. Fight fans want to see that. But sometimes as champion, it's important that you just come here and get your job. We'll be happy with that. We've got a scene of him here smiling. He's got a new WBO. He thoroughly deserves it. He did what he had to do to win. Powerful, dangerous from America. It's still the fight we want. If he was a little flat against Carlos Takam, he was much better tonight. Behind his jab. He's had 21 fights. He's got four belts. Deontay Wilder was supposed to be here tonight. But you see where he boxes? He boxes in some great venues with no one there. Look at what we're doing over here. Look at what Anthony Joshua is doing. Deontay Wilder will be...